video though today we are going to be making cake pops with only three ingredients this is going to be a vanilla cake pop inspired tutorial so let's get right into it the first thing you're going to need are your oreos i'm using these vanilla oreos because i want a vanilla inspired cake pop but if you want a chocolate inspired cake pop go ahead and use chocolate or cream cheese and some white chocolate or milk chocolate depending on your preference. My sticks ready, I'm gonna go ahead and use sticks for this recipe, but you can also leave them um, stickless and just use them as like little truffles, it's really just up to you. For decoration, I did get some colorful sprinkles, but that's completely optional. First thing you're gonna do is pour the Oreos into a Ziploc bag. You're gonna have to smash them. I'm just gonna use this metal soup pour, but you can go ahead and use whatever you have at home that's gonna be heavy enough. So now comes the fun part. Make sure you really, really break it down to almost a powder consistency. Another quick tip for you guys is if you wanted to put it into a blender, like a small blender, that probably would be a better idea. Now, once your Oreos are looking like grains of salt, go ahead and pour them into a bowl. Go ahead and open your cream cheese and pour some in there. You only need really, really little and it's better to pour less than to overdo it. But if you were to overdo it, you can always just balance it out by adding more Oreo. How much I'm using for this amount, so honestly, you don't need a lot of cream cheese. Mix it up. This also takes a while. If you did it with a mixer, it'd probably be quicker. Guest appearance. Out. <laughs> okay, so once your dough is ready, go ahead and roll them up into little balls. So they should be looking like this. They're so cute. Go ahead and melt some of your chocolate. Grab your stick. Dip the tip into some of that white chocolate. Tip a little bit. And once it's like this, go ahead and stick it into your cake. So I have my chocolate in this little cup. So you just grab your cake pop. So that's how it's looking right now. You can go ahead and add some sprinkles on top like this. Leave it in the fridge for about 15 or 20 more minutes until the, until the chocolate on the exterior gets really cold. Delicioso. Mm. Oh my god, it's really good. Really good, Patty. I'm gonna take another piece. It's so good. Mm. Mm. Really good, Patty. 